three steps for motivation when you don't see the change. Hey, it's Alicia String here, and I'm reading Switch! How to change things when change is hard. I'm out here with my buddy. Great listener, let me tell you. And we're reading together. He's reading, and I'm reading, and I've got some ducks over here with me somewhere, and thankfully they are not fighting at the moment. We've been seeing some action happen. They're all peaceful now. And the wind is blowing. It's a beautiful day out here in Texas. And I wanted to share with you um, the ending point of when the problem is people don't see the need to change. So the advice is given. Number one, you're not going to overcome this by talking to the writer. Instead, find the feeling. Can you do a dramatic demonstration to find the feeling of the impact of why things need to change. And the example they gave is like a glove shrine, which there was a factory or worker that everybody needs to have gloves. And everybody bought their own gloves, so they all had different um, kind of styles or how much they cost, you know, 50 cents to $13 to 20 plus dollars, right, on the different types of gloves. So they're asking all these workers um, all the different kinds of gloves. And they made a whole huge pile of how many gloves there were to try to figure out how we can cut costs for everybody and see what's efficient. And putting all those gloves together was a, can see the impact of how much money you can truly save when you see how many people are using different kinds of gloves, right? So that's a, people don't see the need to change, that is the change that you can see dramatically when you see all the differences. Number two, show empathy. Show people the problems with not changing. And they give an example of Attila is the um, authoritative, the yeller, and um, says it's gotta be done this way. And he went into the nonprofits to see why they were not um, giving back, you know, our making the payments on time or different things like that and he went into the field and saw what was like cutting the clothes the the line and seeing why it was so variety it's like survival out there and he didn't realize how bad it, the situation was and now he came back and saw that you know we want to try to make sure this is fixed so we can give out the paychecks in time and this thing this the reason why this doesn't happen so it was more of an encouragement and he's still the yeller still the same person but he also was able to see the difference and see I guess the I want to say the why right I don't know why is so important number three tweak the environment so people can see the need to change is irrelevant um, so remember um, they said the rack place employees here I'm gonna give you an example of that and they didn't necessarily see the need to improve customer service, but after call queuing system disappeared, they had to pick up the phone. So um, with a lot of new online companies, they hate the phone service for customer support, kind of like Facebook, like does anybody know his Facebook phone number? <laughs> right? And um, thankfully I do have a Facebook guy I'm talking to, <laughs> one bless it there and when the support is gone what happens and it seems like the whole company changed um, because people actually picked up the phone and the company came back alive because of that factor um, the environment changed where they didn't see the name change because they never picked up the phone to talk to people the customer service but they changed their whole marketing strategy their whole business because they started picking up the phone with customer service and they saw all these problems arise and we were able to fix it. Isn't he a great listener? I love this. <laughs> and the ducks too, they're doing a pretty good amazing too over here. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. And I wanted to share the solutions when you may not see the change but people need to change. That might be a motivation factor that um, it may not make sense right now, but things are gonna change. I might cry a whole lot, and whatever process you need to get through to make change happen, it'll happen. All right, so there's number one. There's like 11 more. 
<laughs> Maybe I'll come out and make a video of it and have a great listener. I hope that helps you motivate when you don't really understand the change of it. You'll see it through the feeling or the empathy or the environment it will happen. Enjoy your beautiful day. Like the one sleeping right there. <laughs> and um, click like, share, and get into my ilivefull.com and live life fully. Lots more things happening when you're truly motivated. Have a great day. Bye guys.